Uh-oh. 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 Colt's got on. The... Whoa. Woo Bigger fish are going to be in the deep. Oh, gosh. Jesus. He felt like he hit the blade. He didn't feel like he hit the jig. Oh, baby. He smoked it. Woo-hoo, son. This way. Oh, big rooster. Oh, flying fish. <laughs> yeah, man. Fist bump. Big rooster. Boom, baby. What's up and welcome back to Georgia Boy Outdoors. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel, like the video, and click on the notifications icon. We're back. Well, <laughs> sort of back. Cole's halfway through his first tea glass and I'm sipping on the coffee, but hmm. Satilla River float trip. That's all I gotta say. We are going public access point to public access point. I'm gonna tell y'all where we're at later and how to fish this. This is where I grew up. This is my wheelhouse. My favorite stretch of the Satilla River. I mean, this takes me back to the days of Stephanie James. Shout out mama. You know, walking down to the sandbars with me when I was Colt's age, doing some fishing. Me and Colt's going all through there. It's gonna be good stuff, but hey, it's time to get out on the water. Come on, we want to lose weight. Wait, no, you, yeah, hold on. You're going to take a big step? I'm going to hold you. You got to take a big step now. Now sit down right there. Good thing for us. We ain't got no choice. What? Hey, this, this that other log actually helps. You know, you know what I mean? Because, yeah, it lets me bounce back and forth. I, dude, you don't know how many times I've busted my tail <laughs> by myself. Yeah, there we go. All day, baby. Here, so hold on. Let's do. It's all pretty shallow. Hold on. Sometimes. Yeah, literally. The wheels. This is where you get snake bit. You gotta watch what you're doing here. All right. All right. Ooh. That's what'll make a. I said, that's what'll make a snake come out. Uh. All right, come on. Here, Colt, this crawdad drops off deep under by that log. Come over here, you good? Come on, come on. You got <laughs> You gotta bend on down, you good? Go, go higher where it's higher. Come over here where it's higher, you good? You ain't gonna get snake bit, get up, boy. This is something cool to see. On this float trip, this is what us local folks refer to as the rocks. Bunch of boulders when the river's down about another foot. It'll blow your mind. You're floating sandbar to sandbar and then back here for no reason at all. There's all these rocks. So we've paddled down a good ways this morning, about an hour or so. Uh, we've hit a couple spots. We've only fished a total of about 10 minutes. We just really wanted to cover some ground first thing. But yeah, definitely the rocks. If you catch it a little lower than what we did today, something cool to see. Yeah, and it, you can tell. Um, usually a channel cat's gonna be on the deeper side of the river. Yeah, he ain't gonna be on the sandbar side. Most of your bigger fish are gonna be in the deep. Oh gosh, Jesus! Oh my lord, look at that! Cut my dang line! Oh, oh my gosh! I have no clue what that was. Wow. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Colt's got on. Whoa. Woohoo, Lord, what a mud fish. He's about to break it. Hey, hey, loosen your drag, son. It's good. Is he slipping it, son? Yeah, that's good. Let him slip it. That is a big mud fish, son. Good, Lord. We got to get him to the sand. He has got a big mud fish that is testing the eight pound trilene. Oh. He's about to get out on the sand. This is a big one. Man, oh man. Let's work him on up. Here, easy, easy. He's going to rip that line. Come on, that's a big one, Colt. I ain't a mudfish man, but I want to catch that one. That's a that's a big one. Woo, son, that is a mudfish, son. I got him. Here, hold on. <laughs> that is a that is a tank, boy. Good lord. Hold on, that is a tank. <laughs> Golly, son. That's a beast, Colt. That's another one. 
There we go. There's a fish. That one? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Bluegy, I think. Oh, oh, oh. Net man, net man, you're fired. Well, you win the blue deal. Yeah, you got the first fish. Hey, why don't you say first fish and first big fish? All right, I'll yeah, give you, I'll give you that fair is fair, I guess. Yeah, you, I guess that does count as a double. I know we can catch a speck right here. I know it. Sure is. Or never mind, you don't gotta pay me no money if you get me McDonald's. Oh, I, he just missed it. I think he hit the blade. Let's see if he hits it again. He felt like he hit the blade. Didn't feel like he hit the jig. Oh, baby, he smoked it. Woo, son. I told you he hit that blade. Man, that's what I'm talking about. Rooster. <laughs> Here. Yeah, there you go. All right. Yes, sir. Rooster, rooster. Man, he smoked it. I hope the GoPro got it. He smoked it right beside the kayak. Golly. Well, me and Colt is on them, people. Stay tuned. Uh -oh. oh, yeah. Come on, man. Swing around this way. Oh, big rooster. Oh, flying fish. <laughs> yeah, man. Fist bump. Big rooster. Boom, baby. Colt 45. Oh man, you know me and Colt was talking last night. When he turns 18, he's gonna come back and sue me and his mama for using his name and selling these lures. But maybe by then he'll be all right with me. Or they're gone. He sold. He sold almost 300. I bet some people would want me. That's why I say too. Like literally, we gotta hold on to what we got because there ain't no more right now until I can get some more done. So that's why every one is so important. Oh boy, that one smoked it. I'm gonna take my time, whatever that is. Don't. One second, can I reel up my? Oh. Oh yeah, that's a good red breast. Get ready for him. Nice, Rooster. All on this bank. Before that tree that's across. Oh. oh, I hope that ain't a mud fish. I stopped it. Maybe it ain't. Oh no, that's good fish. I stopped it and he bit it. Good. Nice one. Nice. Oh, I don't know what that is. I think he's all right. You good, bud? He's, oh, little oh. stump knocker. Yeah. What I usually do, let me show you. And it's, I showed you this the other day, but watch this. Little trick I do when I throw it, watch. As soon as it hits the water, I give my rod a little twitch, and that gets the blade started. Not a big twitch, just a little. That's crazy. I think I just. Oh, <laughs> a little one. <laughs> That's probably the fish I saw because I yeah, yeah, he was following them up. But see, I'll give it a little twitch and that gets it started. Not a big twitch because you'll scare fish that are near it. But <laughs> yeah, they'll follow. That's why I say if you watch your spinner, a lot of times you'll see them eat it. I've seen a tiny little fish. Yeah, this current is doing us a Oh, son. Son. Yes, right sir. Yes, sir. Right beside. That's a good one, Colt. Nice and easy. Up. Oh. Uh, oh, oh, there we fish. go. Flying fish. Cold, Cold is the master of flying fish. Rooster. Oh, there we go. Nice one. Yeah, I'm going to try to get him. Oh, 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 hold on, I'm going to swing him up. That's fine. What kind of fish? Bluegill. What's up, guys? While well, my net man's asleep, going over our gear real quick. Zebco Bullet 20 Series Trilene XL 8 pound line Colt 45 spinner bait. If you hadn't already, check out our page on Facebook. That's Georgia Boy Lures on Facebook, not Georgia Boy Outdoors. I like the Colt 45 because it's bigger. And down here, 
it seems like with so many small fish that's in this stretch of the river it, it kind of deters them from biting and helps you get some more quality bites you won't catch as many fish but it sure helps you pick up some of the good ones so that's what we're using um hadn't even throughout the drag chain we're moving way ahead of schedule we'll probably end up taking out i don't know by four four o'clock or so uh been a good day so i'm ready to finish it out maybe we can get something else on the line net man is asleep that's okay oh <laughs> slept right through it what's up guys hey we made it up the hill i'm out of breath about half dead thanks to cole we got up here it is a good little haul if you got a heavier kayak but we're directly across the river from fat daddy's atv park this bridge is considered to be public right of way. So you've got a right to pull a kayak up here. Just be sure, don't trespass on Fat Daddy's property. You'll see the signs. But hey, it's been a good day. It's time for something cold to drink. My man Colt, you got anything? We'll see you next time on the water.